Hey, just in time. Found out who went rooting around in our skulls. And you'll never guess who it was. As a totally unrelated hint, I'm in charge of this boat now. I consider it payment for what he did to my poor, sliced up brain. I was going to do the same to him, but I figured you'd want the honor. Seems that when the tribals would send someone to the swamp, he'd be waiting around to nab them when the punga seeds gassed them. He'd do his amateur surgery for the tribals and let us wander back, all in exchange for punga fruit to trade. Sweet little deal he had going on. Yeah, he seemed nice enough, didn't he? I wouldn't have figured it out if I hadn't snuck into his engine room while waiting for you. From the look of it, he kept every bit of gray matter he cut out, and he had quite a collection. You can take a look, if your stomach's up to it. And while you're in there, feel free to give Tobar my love, preferably with the sharp end of a hot knife. First off, I'm claiming this boat. I put Tobar down, so it's mine. Them's the rules of the ocean. So that leaves me with a boat, a load of punga, and a wicked scar. Damn if I hadn't earned that adventure I came out looking for. I think I'll take over running this ship. I can travel as I like, and always head back to the wasteland to see Mom. Not a bad way to live, huh? Of course, you can always ride for free. Yeah, enough gabbing. Let's move. <coughs> oh, hi. Did you see Well, that? if it isn't my favorite traveler. And oh, what a trip you were on. Why, when you were under, you should have heard some of the things that came out of your mouth. But I suppose you're more interested in what came out of your head, aren't you? Why do we do anything? You travel the world, kill people, take trophies that interest you, and move on. I'm much the same. Only difference is that my trophies are somewhat more medical in nature. Oh, and to be honest, I probably kill fewer people than you do. But I suppose it's time that came to an end, one way or another. Help me out, sir! Hey. Oh, you're back! Yes! Thank you so much! And now that she's got this boat and carrying all this cargo... Well, I can afford to actually pay you! Thank you so much! Thank you so much for your help! <clears throat> Guess we never got a formal introduction, huh? Name's Nadine. I know you're not from around here. So, what brought you out here? You looking for fortune or running from your troubles? What is this, a date? You start making a move and it's stabbing time! Yeah, enough gabbing. Let's move. 